Hey guys, I'm Ryan Wright. And this would be crazy. So we're gonna check out this trailer. Um, it's a mock trailer, I believe. Oh. It has to be. Okay. Star Wars: The Binks Awakens. It's uh, Jar Jar Binks, I guess, included in the new Star Wars movie. So let's uh, check it out. Because everyone knows <laughs> Jar Jar Binks is everyone's favorite character from the Star uh -huh. Wars saga. 100%. Dude, I fucking every time I watch Star Wars, I'm always like, man, I wish, I wish Jar Jar was in more of these movies. Looks legit. Oh no. The force is strong in my family. I have it. My sister has it. You have that power too. He's a back. Oh, dude, I started watching this and like going, what if he really was in it? And I started getting mad. <laughs> I know, I don't think they would do that ever again. Oh, maybe, God. maybe a cameo, maybe, but not. Just not. watching this joke video and then a little bit later, like adjusting to the joke was like, oh, I'd be so pissed off if they threw him in there. <laughs> you know, okay, here's what I gotta say. Yes, he's pretty annoying. Yeah, but he's the comic relief. But yeah, for the first, for episode one, for that whole tone of that whole movie, that was the only one where it would make sense for Jar Jar to be in there. This character, I can see why, you know, George Lucas might have thought that character would work for that one. Oh, well, I mean, they had the whole, you know, thing in the gun city and yeah. Yeah, that was, it was so, very much like, people was, are gonna love this guy. It was all foreshadowing. What, what makes me sad, actually, is for the actor, like, in a genuine way, because that actor start, was the first one to really do motion capture. Right. You know, like, go into this suit and then they CGI, him, but, but it's really a performance. Yeah. And then no one liked it, but then Gollum comes out. That's not true, and I'll tell you why. Because he okay, created an people. immortal character. Everybody knows who Jar Jar is. Yeah, but Everybody. he doesn't have a great reputation. He's the comic relief. He's not supposed to be a serious character. But, but no one even, likes him. But that's not the point. Is I'm saying even though he's not a main character, he's really an annoying character and nobody really likes him. Despite that, created an immortal character. Okay, yeah, but... That doesn't disprove my point. What I was trying to say <laughs> is when Gollum came out, that actor, Andy Serkis, got all this recognition as if he was the first one to do that. But mm. really it was this actor who started off doing motion capture and then he never really got work after this movie. Uh. After episode one, it kind of bums me out that like, oh, that sucks. Because I heard in interviews with like Liam Neeson especially saying like, he did exactly what he was directed to do. Wow. So he he didn't like fuck up Jar Jar Binks. Like he did exactly what the writing said to do and what the directing was saying to do. It's sad because, you know, if, if there was like better direction maybe or better writing, he'd have the career too mm -hmm. of doing motion capture. But now, yeah. Yeah. Well, it's because the guy's black. It's racist shit, you motherfuckers. All comes down to racism. Does it? Yeah, it's because Jar Jar Binks was played by a black guy. 
That's why the fucking studios don't like him. Fucking racist. Was he really? Yeah. Oh. Didn't know that. Oh, well, yeah. Well, now Still. you know, because studios like to keep that shit hidden. Racist out there. I'm trying to say studios are racist, Alyssa. But they're not. Yeah, they are. When's the last time you saw an Armenian guy play a lead in a movie? Anyway, guys, if you're new to the channel, you can subscribe to The Real Rejects. You can follow us on Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter, where if we get enough followers, we get product placement. That's right, people. So, like... Phone cases. It's great because it protects your phone. You know, you never know if you're gonna drop it or sometimes you might be getting head and then you're recording the girl doing it and then you might drop the phone and you know, it, it might hit her head, but if it's just the phone, it's gonna hurt her head. But with the case, it doesn't hurt as much. I know that from personal experience. Phone cases.